I came down to the Eshkol Regional Council uh, along the Gaza border uh, to meet with the uh, council chairman, uh, Chaim Jelin, uh, and to hear from him firsthand about the experience of the residents uh, of the Eshkol region during the recent conflict uh, with, uh, in Gaza. He explained to me the difficulties of life uh, in this area where uh, the residents have had to live with missiles and rockets falling on them for years. Um, sometimes many in a week, many in a month. He showed me the uh, local high school in which every building uh, is built with hardened uh, protective materials uh, as well as uh, many protective structures uh, set up uh, throughout the grounds so that the students and the faculty can always have a place to get to within a matter of seconds when they hear the sirens go off. Uh, we then visited Kibbutz Sufa, which in the recent conflict uh, saw two homes destroyed by uh, missiles that fell uh, during the conflict. Fortunately uh, and miraculously no one was hurt, no one was killed in those attacks, but it's a, a reminder, very vivid reminder, uh, of what uh, the residents in this part of Israel have had to live with uh, and why it was necessary for uh, the United States to support Israel's right to defend itself uh, in the recent conflict. Wow. וזו יונת השלום שנמצאת על הלה של זית, בא במדינת ישראל הקטנה, בתוך מועצת ברית השקול. ואנחנו רוצים להעניק לך את השי הזה, כי הוא חשוב שאתה גם תעביר את המסר שלא תמיד יודעים לקרוא בעיתונים, ולא מופיע תמיד בתקשורת, שיש אנשים שבאמת רוצים לחיות בשלום עם השכנים.